Yabulani Kumalo, founder of MK Party, has escalated his efforts to oust Jacob Zuma as the party's leader by taking his case to the electoral court. Kumalo's legal challenge comes after a series of disputes with the MK Party, which he established in the December of the previous year. In April, he was expelled from the party alongside several colleagues during what the MK Party described as a cleansing process. Kumalo's contention is rooted in his claim that Zuma's assumption of the party leadership was fraudulent. After his expulsion, Kumalo petitioned the Electoral Commission of South Africa to have Zuma removed from the party's leadership roster. The IEC, however, maintained it does not meddle in the internal affairs of political parties and only recognizes the leader registered officially with them. Since April 10th of 2024, the registered leader has been Jacob Zuma. Kumalo's legal argument before the electoral court is twofold. First, he seeks a declaration that Zuma's leadership of the MK party is invalid. Second, he wants the court to direct the IEC to register him as the rightful leader of the MK party. Kumalo's assertion is that his removal and subsequent installation of Zuma was carried out fraudulently and without proper procedure. The IEC's response to Kumalo's complaints has been one of non-involvement, reiterating its policy of not interfering in party-specific disputes unless officially directed by the party's registered leader. This stance leaves the resolution of leadership tasso in the hands of the electoral court, which now has the responsibility to adjudicate on the legitimacy of Zuma's position and Kumalo's claims. Should the court rule in favor of Kumalo, it would mark a significant setback for Zuma, who has already faced numerous political and legal challenges since his presidency ended. Notably, a recent decision disqualified Zuma from standing as a member of parliament added his political woes. A court victory for Kumalo could potentially reshape the leadership dynamics within the MK party and influence his strategic direction ahead of the upcoming elections. The internal conflict within the MK party highlights broader issues within South Africa's political landscape, including factionalism and the challenges of leadership legitimacy. The MK party, like many others, is navigating the turbulent waters as it seeks to consolidate its position and support base. The outcome of Kumalo's legal battle against Zuma could set a precedented for somehow similar disputes are handed within the other political entities. For Kumalo, this legal battle is not just about leadership but also about reclaiming his vision for the MK party. His expulsion and subsequent legal challenges represent a significant political and personal crossroads. A favorable court ruling would vindicate his stance and potentially restore his influence within the party. Controversially, a defeat could further marginalize him and solidify Zuma's control over the MK party.